All right. Now we're doing Freight Code Camp, JavaScript Algorithms and Data Structures Beta. Learn form validation by building a calorie counter. Step 41. All right. So we will want to number the entries a user adds. Uh, to get all of the number inputs, we can use the query selector all method. Uh, the query selector all method returns a node list of all the elements that match the selector, okay? Uh, a node list is an array-like object so we can access the elements using bracket notation. All right. So let's uh, let's go check out uh, the MDM page on this because this is the first time I've ever seen this. So let's uh, get let's get a double check on this, right? So let's look over here. Uh, we're we're going to put uh, query selector all in the Google bar. Come over here and we see the document method query selector all returns a static but not live node list representing a list of the document's elements that match the specified group of selectors, okay? So the selectors are gonna be a string containing one or more selectors to match against. This string must be a valid CSS selector string, and if it's not, a syntax error exception is thrown. And uh, we can see locating DOM elements using selectors for more information about using selectors to identify elements. Multiple selectors may be specified by separating them using commas. All right. So uh, I guess we're going to go into the selector on the what we're going to put in here uh, on the next one. But right now we're going to declare a, pardon me, declare an entry number variable and give it a value of target input container dot query selector all uh, method like that. And then uh, we don't need to pass an argument into the query selector just yet. All right. So we're gonna declare entry number to start off with. So we'll do const, const entry number, all right? And that's gonna equal this thing here, dot query selector all, like that. And then let's just cap it off with a semicolon at the end. So let's check the code. Looks good and submitted. All right. Now we're on to step 42, and we'll see you next time.